Hey guys, Tyler here with Let's Fix This. We're gonna walk you through the steps of how to get the new Maytag and Whirlpool washer into Diagnostics. In Diagnostics, you can check for error codes. This is also how you're gonna recalibrate the washer in case it's just not working quite right. So let's begin. First thing you're gonna do is rotate the knob counterclockwise. I usually like to do one to two full turns and then end up at normal. From there, you're gonna twist it right, 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 left, right, and you're gonna get all of the LEDs that are gonna light up. That lets you know that you've gotten into diagnostic mode. Now, if you highlight the done portion, that will put you into the error code mode and push start. It's gonna flash a series of lights and that's gonna kinda of tell you what's wrong. So this was flashing two blinks and then one blink uh, sorry, it's a little blurry, but uh, if you look right there, the two blinks and then the one blink tells you we have a long fill error and then gives you some ideas of what you can do to get rid of that error and things that you can check. So after you've found the first error, if you rotate the knob clockwise, it will go to the next error. In this case, there's no more errors. You'll then need to hold the start button for a good five six, seven seconds or so until the lights stop flashing and that pulls you out of diagnostic mode so that we can then go back in and calibrate the washer. So you're gonna rotate counterclockwise and then you're gonna go right, 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 left, right. In order to get to calibration mode, you're gonna turn it right four times and it will put you on the rinse light. And then push start. From there, the washer is gonna go through and uh, reset the motor, the shifter, the control and put everything back to factory settings. This will also get rid of any error codes that were stored in there. And once again, thanks for watching and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe down at the bottom corner.